Hi guys, today I got some things from Amazon and I'm going to reorganize my closet a little bit because right now everything, I just kind of thrown everything in bags. So after work, I will go ahead and do that. I took a quick little walk, really quick walk. I took like a 10, five minute walk. And I'm gonna get to my closet organization. These are the storage boxes or the storage bins that I got in my shoe rack. This is my current closet setup. So I have bags here. Um, everything that's in those like space saving bags, they're all like pajamas or sweats or workout clothes. These are actually all my clothes for all seasons. So I don't even have to put like winter or summer clothes away really. Here are some shoes. I actually moved a lot of my shoes to my um, coat closet. Um, and then here is the rest of my closet. So I share this with like my bathroom towels and then bags and my pants. And I wanted to do like two shelves for pants and then two shelves for the baskets. And I plan to move all my bags up there. Also these really cute baskets, I got these from Amazon. They were four for about $45, so about 10-ish dollars, a little more, but yeah, 10-ish dollars each. All right guys, so I was able to sort some things. I know, not the prettiest display, but I have like my workout stuff, I have my underwear, which I'm not showing you, my towels and my socks, and I'm gonna bring them to the shelf. I have these two shelves dedicated to all of my jeans. Um, these bottom two shelves have storage bins, my socks, underwear, um, workout stuff, and like towels and picnic blankets are all there. Um, down here, I have spare hangers, yeah. That is the space. Right, now that that's taken care of, I have all of these. These are all sweats and pajamas. Under my bed, I have these space store, uh, these storage bags that I like didn't really use. I have these two comforters, which I think would be cute to throw in the winter, but it's too warm for that right now. Then I have another one that I haven't used yet. So I think I'll put all my sweats and pajamas here. of my closet i'm actually very tired and i'm going to assemble my shoe rack are you ready it's going to be done all right voila it is done it has three tiers and then i'm gonna put it in my closet i just came home went to socially distance with some friends came home to two packages one is a paper towel roll which i really need and then the second thing, the fake vines that I'm going to hang up in my closet. So I'm going to set that up tonight because I'm very excited for it. Um, and I also got my black hangers, which I unpacked before I left. So excuse the mess, but um, this is the before. Up there, I think that used to be like e-bags, like random stuff on here. And now I just like put my bags on display. So yesterday while Christian was here, I asked him to just put up those command hooks, which I could have done myself with a step stool, but it just helped to have someone tall, you know? And then I got this really light curtain rod from Bed Bath & Beyond and it would only cost $4.99. So these command hooks were like $5 for like a pack of 20. And then I got this curtain rod. So I think it'll be heavy enough to hold down the vines, um, yet light enough to be held by the not so strong command hook. So we'll see how it goes. And in the meantime, um, I'm not really gonna talk because I'm tired, but if you guys are reading books or looking for a new book to read, um, I'm in a book club with my coworkers slash friends. And right now we're reading a YA novel, which is always a good choice. Um, we're, we're reading They Wish They Were Us, and it's actually really entertaining. And I do audiobooks just because I can multitask. If you guys have any recommendations, please let me know. I also listen to podcasts too, so if, any if you have any recommendations for podcasts, please let me know.
I have to trim a little bit because it's a little uneven, so I'm gonna do that. And then I color coordinated everything. These are velvet non-slip hangers for my pants because pants slip off easily. And then these plastic hangers are really great for everything else, for like tops and sweaters, so they can just easily slip off. And then all of my shoes used to be down here, but I'll show you where they are now. So come on, come on. Um, so now they're in my supply closet. So this is like my supply slash coat closet slash recycling. So I put my recycling in here, like water bottles. And then here I have my hats. These are all my coats. These are grocery bags that I would reuse. So all my coats are winter. All my shoes are here. I built this shoe rack, as you have seen. And then here are my cleaning tools. <laughs> I don't have a vacuum or anything. I think the price is on at $6.99. I have a mop, my Swiffer, and then this duster thing. Before I really say goodnight, I wanted to show you how these light up because I just added the lights. It comes with this battery pack um, and you have to supply your own three AA batteries. And then there's a little button right here. Click it and you have different light settings. Dude, guys, isn't that so dope? This one's my Christmassy fairy. This one's like starry night. This one's just like flashing, which I would not want for sleeping. This one is so cute. Isn't that so cool? And then yeah, off button. I just got my mirror that I've been waiting for and it was really hard to get into the apartment, <laughs> but I will somehow set it up. You ready? Ta-da! You like my outfit? Oh my god, this was really difficult to move. It's so heavy. A lot of the time, I get big packages that I have trouble bringing inside, and I see people pa um, passing by, and I almost want to ask them for help because it's so hard, but I'm committed. I can do things on my own. Yeah, so this mirror can lean against the wall or it also has a stand right now it's on the the standing position um i want to lean it against the wall so i have more space but i'm just worried that it would like break and fall so for now this is what it is mm -hmm. 